So yeah, that's my trike on skis and unfortunately the cord for the pull start got caught up in the recoil starter drum and basically tore this apart. Anyway, I'm waiting on parts and I thought, well, why not go ahead and make a set of homemade skis for my dad's trike so that uh, we can both fly together in the snow. So. I thought I'd uh, go ahead and do that and film it and uh, maybe it would help you if you wanted to do the same. Now there's lots of ways to skin a cat and uh, you can make skis a lot of different ways. I'm going to use the method that I'm familiar with just with aluminum plate and some UHMW uh, for the bottom skid. And uh, some rivets and we'll put it together so let's get to it all right so the plan is to start with this sheet of aluminum here this is 080 uh, it's almost like 330 seconds of an inch and that'll make the the base of the ski and then we have this stuff called hat section or hat channel looks like a hat when you look at it in cross-section and that'll be the uh, longitudinal support of the ski and then to this we'll connect the lifter that'll take it up to the height of what a wheel would be and that's made out of eighth inch aluminum and then on the bottom of the ski we'll attach the UHMW uh, slick plastic material and then we'll connect it all together with these steel rivets which are basically uh, 3 sixteenths of an inch in diameter okay I got some help from my daughter to do this next step This one we're going to cut the UHMW at 10 inches. Okay, you ready? Yep. long. So I've got those marked and we'll cut them off. And we'll make the UHMW 40 inches long. That'll give us an inch on either end. to bend our ski tip, get that up at about 30 degrees. I'm going to bend about 8 inches of it and I made a really cool uh, metal break on my workbench so let's uh, put that to use.
What I found was when you try and push your trike back in the snow, if you don't have a little uplift on the back of the ski, it'll dig in. So that's what we're doing now. See that? All right, well now it's time to measure and cut the hat section to fit on the uh, top of the aluminum. Okay, so uh, we're at the stage now where we're trying to cut and measure the hat section to fit onto the metal part of the, of the ski. And what I'm going to do now is I've, I've got this angle pretty, pretty close, but now I'm going to cut some angle aluminum to fit inside there, and then we'll start to rivet it up. That looks pretty good. I just gotta make five more of them. Uh, now we're just going to attach them with steel rivets. Well, here's one side. See what that looks like. I just gotta put the other one on. There it is. Next step, do two more, and then we put the UHMW on the bottom and the extenders on the top for the wheel. Well, this is uh, my dad's trike, six trike behind me. It still has its tires on, and that's the whole point. We're trying to switch from tires to skis. But uh, we're at the stage now where we're trying to get the proper height off the ground so we have plenty of prop clearance. So I'm going to actually measure that height so I can cut and build the correct size of lifters to attach to these skis. So I'm going to do that right now. The material for the lifters is actually a little thicker. It's uh, about an eighth of an inch thick. And it comes with this uh, green cellophane on it, so we'll just take that off and we'll start measuring.
Well, now it's time to uh, use the take the one by two block of aluminum, measure, cut it for three uh, places for the axle to go through. Cutting off this uh, block, solid aluminum. It's a little heavy, but uh, we're going to drill holes in it, make it lighter. That's going to accept the axle. And then these lifters will attach to it like so. And that will attach to the ski right here like that. Well now it's time to bend the lifters to the right angle to fit on the skis and we need to make them so that they're vertical coming off so that's the plan right now. Well we got them all bent now it's just time to assemble them. Okay, we're down to the final stage where we're going to use some uh, 3 16 aluminum rivets just to save some weight. And we're going to attach the uh, uh, UHMW to the uh, ski. So that's what we're working on right now. And I'll show you what that looks like right there. Okay, well, 
here's the final ski and uh, that's gonna go in your trike. <laughs> this thing of beauty! Whoa! Uh, just <laughs> under 10 pounds. Uh -huh. <laughs> ah. And uh, just for comparison, tire here. So it's three tenths of a pound heavier than the tire.